oh my god i'm starting to, I'm starting to cry <laughs> what the hell um i didn't think i would be getting emotional Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, new setup. I really like it. I've sorted myself out. <laughs> so today I thought we would talk about mental health in lockdown because unless you hibernate for winter, spring, summer and fall, you might know that there's a global pandemic going on. That is a thing that's happening right now. And if you live in the UK, you'll know that we have been in lockdown for, well, since the 23rd of March, and it is the 18th of June today. So three months-ish, which is quite a while. And I know that I've been really struggling with my mental health. And I thought that probably quite a lot of people have, so I wanted to make a video about how I'm dealing with it so when lockdown started my college closed the week before we closed on the 18th of March and all of a sudden we didn't have college anymore and that was that was quite weird we still had like online classes but we weren't going to college four days a week like we were normally doing we weren't doing our show anymore and the first couple of days I was like great I've got so much time on my hands now I'm gonna have a really good time I bleached my hair literally the day after college closed and I was doing a workout every day and I was walking the dog I was doing my college work and that lasted for a month maybe um maybe not even that then all of a sudden I lost all my motivation to do anything. I wasn't sleeping. I didn't want to do my workout anymore. I didn't really brush my hair. I didn't put makeup on. Like, I was really, really struggling. And I didn't really realise it because it was kind of slow. Like, I hurt my knee again. I've got a lot of knee problems. And while I was doing my workout one day, I really hurt my knee. So obviously I didn't do it for a couple of days. I was like, okay, I'll, I'll rest it. And then when it's better, I will start doing it again. And I didn't want to. <laughs> it's as simple as that. I was just like, no, what's the point? What's the point? And, you know, obviously I love makeup. It's one of my favourite things. And again, I was just what's the point no one's gonna see me no one cares what's the point in doing my makeup what's the point in brushing my hair just chuck it up in a bun and even for like college classes I was like no don't care I'm there but they don't count towards our grades so who cares and I, re I really struggled I was really struggling. I, I wanted to make videos, but I made a few. And you know when you look at someone and there's just like nothing behind the eyes? That that was me in all these videos. And I was like, oh. No, <laughs> not good. And it, it made me really sad to see myself like that. But I was also just like, um, oh, well, whatever. Okay, so the camera angle might be slightly different because my camera died, but I'm back. Yeah, so all that footage is just, um, never gonna see the light of day, basically. Which is a shame, because there's quite a lot. <laughs> I just really struggled to find the motivation to do anything. Like, I did my college work, and it was basically all I had the energy for, just doing that and i haven't been sleeping like i said and it it's it's been really hard i'm not gonna lie like i i love making videos i don't love college work <laughs> but i i i really do love making videos and it's just i'll come up with an idea for a really good video 
and I'll start, I'll sit down to film it and I, I, I'll completely lose interest in what I'm talking about and I, I've just been finding that really hard and it's just, I found lockdown really hard and everyone was joking like at the start like oh you don't do anything anyway you'll be fine you don't go out I say everyone my dad and yeah for the first couple of weeks I was having a great time having some lions not really doing much talking to my friends a bit having a really good time and very very quickly I started to struggle and I think a lot of people did as well I think it wasn't just me but one thing that I found really helpful for me personally is just getting up and doing my makeup because it is something that I love it makes me feel happy it makes me feel ready to face the day and it makes me feel good about myself and I know I'm aware that that sounds really stupid and really kind of I I, I need makeup to make me pretty but I've I really struggle with my self-esteem as well and you know like I think a lot of us might have I've gained a bit of weight in lockdown after gaining some weight because I injured myself and couldn't do anything so I've I've been really struggling and I've started doing like strength based workouts instead of just cardio because the cardio stuff is really painful for my knee but the strength stuff isn't as bad like my right leg is significantly weaker than my left leg and I know that but the strength stuff makes me feel good and I've been doing that every day just like slowly building up the reps and stuff because I don't have weights in my house and that's also been like a bit of a motivation I feel pretty good and I just think like if if anyone is watching this who is struggling with their mental health start the day off by doing something that you love like if it's makeup put on a full face of makeup and just spend some time doing that if it's working out spend a bit of time doing a workout in the morning and just get yourself energized if it's having a bath with some bubbles and a candle do that start your day off with something that makes you happy and and get out of bed I'm not too good at that bit <laughs> but get out of bed and speak to people like if you can call one of your friends do it even if it's just like voice notes do that so you can hear someone else's voice other than the person you live with if you live with other people or your own voice if you don't voice note people because it's very easy to not speak to anyone all day especially if you don't live with someone and that's not good we need we need contact with people so that's my advice start the day off with something that you love and hear someone else's voice every day even if it's just a voice note and you know it, it's a scary time at the moment it is really scary because not only do we have the coronavirus pandemic going on there's also been protests for the black lives matter movement there, there's a lot going on in the world at the moment that is genuinely scary yemen is in massive crisis and no one's talking about it there's a lot to be anxious about and I think that there's things that we can do not only to help but also to help ourselves and both are equally as important so I think because I don't want to go off on a massive tangent I think I'm going to leave it there so if you did like this video please make sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you are new also you can follow me on twitter and instagram which is just cicely amelia and yeah i'll see you in the next one
Bye.